in today's lesson we are going to look at how we can use the Nova theorem to prove trig identities question use the Nova theorem to show that tan 3 theta is equal to 3 tan theta minus tan chop the theta divide by 1 minus 3 tan squared theta yes as part of the solution as part of the solution now the Nova theorem states that cos of theta plus i sine of theta power n it can be written as cos we get this n we multiply it here plus i we get this n we multiply it here and we get sine n theta now the question tells us that we want to prove or to show that this tan 3 theta is equal to tan 3 tan theta minus tan cube the theta out of 1 minus tan square the theta therefore we have to use the idea of trig to know what does this one what mean so we know that tan 3 theta is equal to sine 3 theta uh -huh, out of cos 3 what 3 theta and when we look at this so our n can be written as what a 3 so we can come here and we say that our cos theta plus i sin theta given our n is 3 it can be written as cos 3 theta plus i sin 3 theta mm -hmm. since we have that one student what we are going to do we are going to expand the left hand side cos theta plus i sine theta we have to expand it and we are going to use pascal's triangle which is one 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 uh -huh. one get one plus one which is a two uh -huh. one plus oh first write a one then one plus two three two plus one three and the one therefore we are going to get this first coefficient which is a one multiply it by cos we shall have cos theta plus get this three multiply it with cos theta cos theta then times i sine what theta also plus get this three multiply it with cos theta times multiply it with i sine theta then plus we are going to multiply we are going to multiply this guy with the one which is i sine theta now we are going to increase the powers of sine and to reduce the powers of cos for example here cos started with three it reduced to two it reduced to one then here it went to a zero here the powers of i cos theta the powers of i sine theta were zero here it increased to one here it increased to two and here it went to three good hope we are understanding numbers so now we shall have our left hand side it will be equal to cos chub the theta plus 3 cos square the theta times i sine theta yes then 
uh, we have i ha i squared we have our i squared and you know that i squared is what negative one so we shall get our negative one times three which is minus three cos theta and sine squared what theta here we also have i cubed we have i cubed i cubed and this one is the same as i squared times i and our i squared is negative and where of it is negative i so we shall have it as negative i sine cubed what theta so that one means that one means that that one means that our cos 3 theta plus i sine 3 theta is equal to mm -hmm, cos cubed theta plus 3i cos squared theta sine theta then minus 3 cos theta sine theta but sine theta is what squared then minus i sine cubed what theta now we are going to equate real parts to real parts and imaginary parts to imaginary parts now our first real part which is cos theta or cos 3 theta on the left is equal to we have cos cubed theta minus um, here has i which is a complex and here doesn't have any i and here has i which is a complex therefore we have minus 3 cos theta sine squared what theta we can say that that is our equation star also we have i sine theta sine 3 theta on the left it is equal to we have a complex here and also a complex there so we shall have i we open brackets 3 cos squared theta sine theta minus sine cubed theta and this i can be cancelled out and we said that we said that if we have a term 3 theta it can be well expressed as sine 3 theta out of cos 3 theta and we have an expansion of sine 3 theta which is this as well as expansion of cos 3 theta which is that therefore just we, we just plan it in our what our term 3 theta and we shall have our sine 3 theta we said we said that it is 3 cos squared theta sine theta minus sine 3 theta or sine cubed theta divide it by um, divide it by cos cubed theta minus 3 cos theta and the sine squared what theta now students let me take you back in our original equation in our original equation they told us that we need to prove that tan 3 theta is equal to 3 tan theta tan cubed theta 1 then minus 3 tan squared what theta now our expansion here we have a cos cubed theta but in the other one it was a one therefore we are going to stress ourselves on transforming this guy to what to one and how can we do it it is quite simple what we are going to do what we are going to do we are going to divide 